Done. Well, we're ready to do some testing on Cobalt. I've got the inside wiring of the robot almost complete, but before I put all the speed controllers and the radio box in the robot, I want to bench, te bench test the entire wiring system to make sure everything's wired correctly and everything's working. So with that, we will turn it on and uh, see if it's working. Let's power up the radio first. This would be the equivalent of turning on the drive, which fires up the BEC for the weapon controller. So apparently the uh, Team Delta switch is on, but not radio communication yet. Or I guess it is. And let's power up the weapon and drive. Okay, I'm backwards. Ha! I don't know. This isn't my robot. I'm just here to drive it. Okay, so solid lights mean uh, we've got radio there. Let's uh, try driving first. Hopefully these front lights will come on. We are driving straight forward. Both lights are solid. So if I wiggle the stick, you can see the one that flashes means it's slowing down and the light will dim. So that's correct. That's right and left or right yeah, that's right. <laughs> Back up. They're going. Opposites. Opposites. And now we have the weapon. To power the weapon, I will push throttle forward. Throttle comes on at 66% and the weapon is going. Apparently everything's good. Weapon turns off. Weapon turns on. Let's go ahead and do a fail safe test. This is going to be hard to do. Yeah, you do. Okay. So, drive is full forward. Weapon is turned on. Turning the radio off. And everything goes into neutral, and the weapon turned off. It worked! It freaking worked! All right. Now i got to get all this cleaned up and put in there. Till next time.